happy first week of school. This is the first week of school lunches, first full week for us. So I have a daughter in pre-K named Isabella. I have a son in sixth grade named Kent. And then I bring my lunch and my husband brings his lunch too. So today I've got three lunches for you. My husband's gonna be off tomorrow, so I'm not gonna show his lunch, but I will the rest of the week. So my daughter, we're going for the homemade Lunchable type thing. She has this cute little bento box. She's got uh, ham cubes here, uh, cheese cubes here. She has these adorable Cheetos. They're the Cheeto Paws. I found these at the store and just thought they were super cute. Thought she would think that was fun for the first week of school. Um, she also has a Go-Gurt. And then she has a cheese stick, fruit snacks, and then a little bit of mini chocolate chips for a treat in there for her first day. To drink, she'll have a water bottle, and then she also has one of these organic super fruit punch from Honest Kids. They also have snack time at her school, so I'm going to pack her um, an applesauce for her snack. And then since it's like her first full week, I'm also going to pack two little chocolate chip cookies. And then this super cute unicorn napkin to go with her unicorn lunchbox. So that is everything Isabella's taking. It might be too much. I'm not sure. She's usually a snacker, like she grazes throughout the day. So I just wanted to give her a lot of options. I wasn't sure what she would be in the mood for, um, but this seems like a good amount of food for her. Um, so I'll see what she comes home with and see how this goes. Now my sixth grader, he can eat <laughs> a lot, but I think he'll really like his lunch. He has um, a ham and Colby Jack sandwich with mayo and mustard. He has um, some grapes, some grape tomatoes. These are like his favorite thing to snack on. He's got one of these sausage sticks, a Colby Jack cheese stick. Um, he has these Doritos that are his new favorite. We've just discovered these. They are the spicy sweet chili. He's really into spicy stuff right now, so I packed him those. And then he's got two chocolate chip cookies. And he, I have no doubt in my mind, he will eat every last bite of that. So that's what he is taking. Then for myself, I meal prep today. So I have some grapes. I have some ham just rolled up. This is like one serving of the honey ham. Then I have cheese cubes. This is also one serving of that. And then I have a hard boiled egg that I cut in half and put some salt and pepper on and then put back together. I like to put them in bags. I know it's a lot of plastic, but it keeps everything separate. It keeps from, you know, the, the egg making the ham taste weird or the cheese making the egg taste weird. You know, it's just, I like everything separate, but I like to just pack it all at once. So that way I'm ready for the week. And then I also have these for a snack for later. These are from Kroger. They're like little mini rice cakes and they are creamy ranch flavor. So that looks really good. So that is what I'm taking. I'll just drink water throughout the day. So these are our lunches for Monday. See y'all tomorrow. All right, guys, we survived the first Monday of back to school. So here are our lunches for Tuesday. So for Isabella, my pre kayer she's gonna have a Lunchable, making it really easy on myself today. She's gonna have a fruit punch and then also her water to drink. She loved those little Cheeto paw things. She ate every single one of them. So I'm giving her some more of those. And then her favorite vegetable in the world is cucumbers. So I'm gonna give her some of those with it. And I just put a little bit of salt on them. And then she's gonna have a chocolate chip muffin with that. These are the homemade kind, like they're from Krusty's. And then for her snack, um, it's already in her backpack, but it's gonna be the exact same as yesterday, the applesauce with the chocolate chip cookies. That was a big hit. And then she's got her poppy napkin, of course. So then for my middle schooler, today he's taking just these like pre-bagged Doritos. Um, I made him a PB&J this time, change it up a little bit. He really loved his sausage and cheese stick. So I'm giving him that. I also threw in a granola bar and some chocolate chip cookies, and then his favorite grape tomatoes. And he would have some more grapes, but he said the grapes were really sour for some reason. So um, 
have to get him some different fruit for next time. But this should be definitely enough for him. So that's for my sixth grader. Then for me, I'm taking literally the exact same thing as yesterday. The grapes, the egg, the ham, the cheese. Um, except instead of those little mini rice cakes today, I have my favorite Triscuits. These are amazing. So I'm going to have these. Um, and then I was still a little bit hungry after I had that, especially like around three o'clock. So I got this uh, packed with protein, light and fit blueberry yogurt. So I'm also going to have that. And then my husband, he works tomorrow. So I packed him two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. He works really long hours, so he needs almost two meals. Packed him a granola bar, some of the Doritos, a cheese stick, and two chocolate chip cookies. So that is everybody's lunch for Tuesday. See y'all tomorrow. All right, guys, here is Thursday's lunch. So for Wednesday, my kids decided they wanted school pizza, so I didn't pack a lunch. I took my meal prep lunch that I'd been taking and then my husband took leftovers, so it wasn't super exciting. So I'm moving on to Thursday. So my daughter is gonna have one of these super fruit punch. She's really been enjoying that. She's also gonna have a Go-Gurt. Um, and then in her compartments, I took a lunch bowl and broke it apart basically and put her crackers in here, her turkey in here, her cheese in here. And then I just added some of those Cheeto paws she's been loving so much and some of her favorite cucumbers. And then she's in pre-K, so they do have snack time. And so for a snack, she's gonna have another applesauce. She's really been enjoying those too. And then one of those homemade chocolate chip muffins for her snack. So that's for my pre-K-er, Isabella. For my sixth grader, he's back to the ham and cheese with mustard and mayo. I packed him some of these little cheese cubes, just whatever was left in our bag of cheese cubes some spicy Doritos that he loves, and a granola bar. And he's going to drink water throughout the day with that. And my lunch is very similar to my son's. I also have a ham sandwich with Colby Jack cheese, mustard, and mayo. And then I've got also the chewy peanut butter granola bar. And then I have my favorite, um, I think these are the cilantro and lime triscuits. And then I have some cheese cubes in there too. And then one thing I was going to show, this is my breakfast. This is totally not sponsored, but I've been loving these so much for breakfast. This company is called Oats Overnight. You can literally go to oatsovernight.com. You can pick out multiple flavors, and all you do is add milk. The macros, if you're into that, like the nutrition, is pretty good. It has 22 grams of fiber, very little sugar a good amount of carbs, and a low amount of fat. So this has been my favorite breakfast in the morning. I literally drink it on the way to work, and it keeps me full. It comes with this little cup. You just shake it up. You put it in the fridge overnight, and then I just drink it on the way to work. And it has been amazing and really filling, which is why my lunch isn't huge, because this really lasts me. So this is what we're taking for lunch and breakfast for Thursday. See y'all tomorrow. All right, guys, we made it to Friday, first week of school, so exciting. All right, here is what Izzy's gonna be taking for Friday. So I used these little cupcake liners and I gave her some ham rolled up here, some Colby Jack cheese here, some of her favorite Cheeto paws there. This is a little pack of fruit snacks. And then um, these are peaches. I just drained the juice out really good and put them in there. And then she's got her treat in there. Again, her chocolate chips that she loves. I'm also gonna put a fruit punch for her drink and then she'll have her water. And then for snack time, she's got another one of these go-go squeezes. So that is everything my Isabella Izzy is taking. Then for Kent, we ran out of bread today so we had to get creative without the sandwiches but he loves these flavored tunas and he loves anything spicy. So I've got a hot buffalo tuna pouch. These are really easy, you just open them up and eat them with a spoon. Then I put in lots of Cheeto puffs. I gave him some mandarin oranges, some Colby Jack cheese, a granola bar. So today he said he was still hungry after his lunch and we need to get to the grocery store. So I'm gonna throw in a Pop-Tart, this is the chocolate fudge kind. So that is everything for Friday, so that should be enough. And then for me, 
I am taking also one of these tuna packs. I love this stuff. It's so good. It's so easy. Uh, really good amount of protein. Um, I'm taking, it looks kind of weird that these are uh, Swiss cheese slices. They just kind of didn't come out of the package nice and straight, but this is just some Swiss cheese to have with that. And then these are the mini rice cakes that I took the other day, the ranch flavor and a granola bar. And my husband still has his lunchbox at work, but I believe he's taking PB&J and some Cheeto Puffs for his lunch. So that is everything we're taking for Friday. See y'all next week.